I'm Brent Demartini here at Demartini RV, and today I want to bring you our Christmas special, the 2017 Road Trek CS Adventurous. So we've just become a Road Trek dealer, and we're really excited to sell these. This company is a really good company, and we really like the product. So why don't you come inside with me, and we'll check out the inside. So here we are in the back of the 2017 CS Adventurous. So you can see that this sofa bed is really spacious for passengers going down the road. You've got like three seats here. You could sit a person here and a person here. And then when you're wet, ready to wind down at night, you can recline it, stop it at whatever position you'd like and watch TV right here. Now that TV does swivel around and face the hall so that you can watch TV from the living room up front where there's swiveling seats in the cockpit. There's also a surround sound right here. This is your home entertainment system, LG to match the TV, plays Blu-rays, and is hooked up to a speaker switch up in there that will switch between the cockpit speakers as well as the surround sound back here. A lot of storage cabinets for a small coach. And this one goes all the way from this from side to side of the coach. Now with the road trek, you've also got a flip up cabinet here so that you can eat and stuff. And then another one slides out right here, little table. And if you want to put a dining table town down, there's a spot for it here so that all of these seats circle around the dining table. Here in the galley, we're proceeding with all of the storage. So you've got a monstrous amount of storage for a class B here. You've got a lot of pantry space there. Um, above, you've also got some more storage too. They've done a really good job about getting storage in this coach. These are backlit. You've got your solar controller there for your roof mounted solar. That comes as an option on this one. And on this coach, we've actually ordered it with 300 watts of solar, just a ton of solar on here. Um, here's the two burner so stove with a flush mount countertop. You've got a flush mount countertop on the sink as well. You get a lot of counter space here with these granite countertops. Um, for the faucet, you just flip it up like that. Then you can also use this if you want to use your InstaHot. Now your InstaHot is ran on a, a timer switch, which is located right here, so that you don't forget to turn it off. Uh, but you can just put it on for a couple minutes if you'd like. Now down here you've got all of this storage, kind of weird shaped drawers, but that's because there's sinks in the way and stuff and they just have to use storage where they can. But down here you just have a ton of storage under the sink. And you've got three of these deep drawers the same size going down. Moving on to the wardrobe. You've got even more storage, this slides out. And that's all of your hanging space in there. You've also got your bathroom over here, which is a wet bath. So you will probably have to sit on the toilet to shower in here, um, but it's a nice option that you can do that in a class B. Now you've also got a corner sink there and a little bit of storage here. Fantastic fan overhead with all LED lighting. This coach comes complete with in-floor heating. Now with the CS Adventurous plan, you do get a full kitchen. So you've got the convection microwave up top in the front here, uh, and down below you've got the seven cubic foot refrigerator so just a monstrous fridge for such a small coach 
Now, you've got the third captain's chair right here in the, in the main galley here. And you can kind of swivel these front seats around, put a table in the middle, and you can have a second gathering area up here up front. Above, you've got both of your switches for your road track, um, eco track banks. So each of these banks is going to be a 200 amp hours on your batteries. Um, if you were to have ordered the full eco track package, you would have 800 amp hours on those. And those are all lithium ion batteries. There's a lot of storage up here. And uh, we're going to go through the control panel now. Here we are at the control panel above the entry. To the left you have your inverter control, which is a pure sine wave inverter. So you don't have to worry about frying your electrical appliances. Uh, now you've got your battery voltage, battery disconnect, uh, so light, some light switches, your tank um, capacities, and if you notice right here, the generator switch is not there. So that is because this coach has the underhood generator. The underhood generator is basically like a big alternator that runs all of your 110 in the coach. So anytime the engine is running, you have full access to everything. Now. This also has volt start. Volt start is basically like an auto gen start for the Mercedes engine. So if your voltage should get below whatever you set it to, I like to set it around 11 and a half volts, then it will start up your generator and run it for 35 minutes, fully charging your batteries and running all of your 110 at the same time. Here's the inside of the cabin area for the Road Trek CS Adventurous. We do have the upgraded cab, so we've got the nice looking wood details as well as a smart wheel, um, the touchscreen controls on the radio functions, as well as some collision avoidance features. One of the nice things about the CS Adventurous is this huge open door and you've got a uh, privacy shade here so that you can, you know, minimize how much sun's getting in and still get a nice breeze through there. Now, close this all the way. You can see the electric step and you can also notice these automotive style windows. This is something that's not done by all the Class B manufacturers, but Road Trek makes a point to put these in because they have a less of a tendency to leak and they're just a lot better windows. Now down here you've got 110 outlets. Here we are in the back and you can see just how much storage there is here. If you open this you can pull that open and get this to get a full 180 degrees. And you can do the same with this really access that storage. Now underneath the bed you'll notice to the right you've got your subwoofer and to the left you've got your inverter and some seat belts there for riding down the road. Moving on, on the driver's side of the vehicle we've got our exterior shower here got your water heater there, exhaust. Down here you've got your hookup for your 30 amp service. Spare tire. And underneath this flip up you've got your macerator pump with this one inch hose. Uh, you've got a manual turn for the for the impeller inside the grinder. That's your your TV hookup as well as your black and gray dumps and propane tank and your water inlet. That's where all your hookups are. And up here you've got your diesel fill 
And another thing is this button right here is for your grinder for your macerator pump. This coach features an integrated power awning with the option to use extendable support arms if needed. Now of course this is on the very popular Mercedes platform and features the Mercedes Bluetech V6 188 horse 3 liter diesel engine. So you're going to get really good gas mileage with the van chassis body and um, can't beat the ride on this so anyway if you guys want send me an email at brent at demartini.com or come visit us on our website demartinirv.com and ask me for the special price thanks for watching